made for uh like rooms you know like like a floor or something like that like something you see over there uh here let me just uh okay so yeah as you see here there's there's a shop in this floor there's uh as this is the first floor right so this is like the first floor so this this is basically the level one grass monster it says the grass monster right there it's supposed to say someone else but it doesn't really matter but yeah okay uh you walk up these stairs when you spawn in you you beat these monsters with your level one weapon and then you you get better weapons by going into here and then it'll magically spawn you somewhere over here it doesn't it, this is all going to be improved but yeah this is uh this is going to spawn you over here and uh ye what was i going to say i should probably have some of this into here i don't need a security in a globe Bop. I feel like I can do better, but at the same time, we take a long time to like you know. But yeah, I'll be, I'll just be doing working on this for like two three weeks. But I'll have to stop this because I have tests and stuff like that to do. So so basically, yeah. Uh, this is a shop. This is the original thing. This is a this is the rebake that I made. If you go into this zone, shop will appear, and uh, shop will appear, right? So it's basically the same thing over here, but this one is kind of broken because if you if you touch, so here, right? Here, enter and leave, right? So you're basically touching both at the same time, and the thing basically reaches out and just enters you in and enters you out every single time which was really annoying so and then i just got rid of that and made uh one thing which just it lets you enter and and i realized that there was like an exit button so i just got rid of the leave here the leave here and uh, yeah but that's all i did for this part which is which works perfectly fine uh, and uh here's boss armor which was made on my own uh, except for maybe the scripting part of, for right here. Uh, it was kind of weird to do because I did this like before, but I didn't remember exactly how I did this. So I just had to search up something in here to use as reference. Uh, let's, I'm pretty sure I've seen this mob in a video. Yeah, I did. Oh, I might use this mob for later, but you know, like not later, but like, you know, just as a as a as a standard like it's script and the, yeah so if you basically if you enter here into shop you'll spawn over here and then you'll go into if you want to buy storage it's here if you want to sell soldiers here uh we'll definitely change the search the, the guis for the selling and buying well and also Basically, here's my list that I'll be doing. Uh, add leader stats did that. Health bar and XP bar did that. Checkpoint haven't done that. <laughs> basically, when I say checkpoint, I basically mean like okay. So let's say this was a map, right? And that was another map. And uh, if if and that is uh, what would, you, what would you call that? Let's say that's a spawn, right? Where you spawn when whenever you reset. What I wanted to happen is whenever you like go into let's say you this is a room that leads to this room and whenever you go into this room right and you spawn over here your permanent spawn will set to here and unless you like go into like a gate that says go return back to spawn and your spawn will or your respawn will be set to here and your spawn will be set to here or yeah you your spawn here and then you also your respawn will also set to be here yeah and basically that's 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 what i want to do that's what i meant by checkpoints uh add inventory basically armor inventory and and sword inventory uh you guys probably already seen this like you know in dungeon quest or any other game like that you'll see armors and stuff like that that will that yeah, you'll see armors, and that's what that kind of inventory that I t that I'm talking about, armors and swords and stuff like that, spells in the same, 
in the same frame and then you, you pre press on the home on the on the inventory and you quit uh fix tool scripting so basically fix something something i don't know what it said but uh here let me just fix tool tip script go in here whenever you like hover over a uh, an item it'll basically give you its stats but what i forgot to do was actually for some reason that that doesn't show up like the how much it costs doesn't show up so i wanted to fix that and you know apply it back in here and yeah uh and then lastly what i wanted to do is change armors from parts to tools which i just said parts to tools basically meaning just add in the inventory and uh make this armor be equitable instead of you have to go on here to wear it you know because this is basically uh surprisingly surprisingly okay well whatever uh Okay, so what was my thing that I said I was going to do? Yeah, so basically that's all for today and uh, maybe all for like until the summer. And I probably won't be posting any videos because I wanted to do this. And basically, and yeah, the uh, reason why I want to do this is... As you guys see this, right? This is like basically all free models. This is basically all free models. I want to be able to actually make my own, uh, my own, uh, you know, like this bridge right here. This is supposed to be a bridge, but this is knockoff bridge and it's called a tunnel. You know, knockoff bridge, ghost tunnel. Trees, got that from a free asset. I think it's free. I don't know if it's stolen or free. It looks way too good to be free, but I guess it's free. You know, I saw another thing, grabbed it. Use it as my thing for currently, and uh, yeah, oh, that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching the video. Peace.